Right, so here it is. Brand new FDR. Which Dad hasn't actually ridden this yet. Huh? Oh. <laughs> He's telling me to watch his luggage. I don't he doesn't doesn't want me scuffing his uh his panniers. <laughs> so yeah, Dad hasn't actually ridden this yet. He's test ridden some different ones, but he hasn't ridden this one yet and so I'm the first person to ride it. Well maybe not the first person to ride it, but he hasn't ridden it yet. So I'll give you my thoughts. So many miles has it got? Well, maybe I am. It's got, it's got one mile. This is nice. This is comfy. I'm obviously not going to go mad because it's, it's not my bike to run in. Well, maybe a little bit. Got it. Screen up. Screen down. Let's go up. Let's try and get the noise down. Man, this is nice. It's a bit more flickable than the uh, the old Triumph. I have no idea what the camera's pointing at either. Only five gears. Uh, I can't get sixth. No, it's only five. It's only a five-speed gearbox. Now this is the ABS, I assume. Say, so you could do some miles on this baby. Sounds quite nice too. Sounds good. Sounds good in the hood. Better not drop it, do I? <laughs> the actual start button is actually the stop as well. It's touring mode, sport mode. Let's leave it in sport. There's so many buttons, I don't know what to do. Menu. Oh, I don't want to. <laughs> that's the grips. Ah, that's nice, man. Overcast today. Yeah, it's a little bit on the overcast side. Still warm. So I'm um, now heading to the sandbar for uh, for lunch. The kids are down the beach. Weird not having six gears. It's definitely not there. It's definitely not there. This helmet is loud. I do apologise, guys. Anyway, so while I'm riding this back, um, I've been meaning to talk talk about this for a while. Um, I'm now affiliated with uh, Revzilla. Um, Yeah, I'm now affiliated with Revzilla. Can I am. Uh, which means, what does it mean? Um, there'll be a link in the description, uh, maybe not in this video, but in future videos. A link to uh, Revzilla through my, through a link in my description. And hopefully I should be able to offer you like free shipping or discount codes on certain items and things like that. Um, and what I get out of it is I get a commission. Whatever you buy through my link, um, I get commissions on. Um, and what I plan to do is probably just let the commission build up, buy some gear, and then give it away as a competition. So 
Um, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I'm not contracted in with anything, but the guys are really helpful. They've given me loads of help. Yeah, hopefully I should have it on this video. So, uh, yeah. Let me know what you uh, think about that. Like I say, I'm not going to earn anything out myself. It doesn't cost me anything to do. It doesn't cost me any work. You know, the link's there. If you want to buy some stuff from Rezilla, do it. And um, I should be able to save you a little bit of money on the shipping or through codes or whatever. Um, yes, everybody's happy. And then hopefully I should be able to give some stuff away because they do international shipping when it's over $300, so I might just save it up and get a whole shed loads of stuff like gloves and what have you, and then um, give it all a, uh, give it all away in one hit. So uh, other people other than in the US can um, benefit as well. Otherwise it's only gonna be the US contingency. <laughs> is that the right word? That's not, is it? He's going to benefit. So, I think that's what's, that's the plan. That's what's going to happen. And um, yeah, we'll uh, hopefully give some stuff away. It's been good. I mean, um, since I've been over here, I've I've got a few numbers from the vloggers, um, AK Dark Knight. Um, salt and downshift uh, yummy spoke to yummy on the phone I tried speaking to AK but the uh, signal was bad so yeah it's good it's been good to talk it's strange talking to them in person well, I've been texting I've texted AK quite a bit spoke to uh, Dark Knight just briefly unfortunately I was uh, it was busy yeah, my old man came back the other day with a, a 2006 KTM 525 SX. It's like, I've had that earlier. Man, I could have gone bust some tracks up with moto. Moto tripping. It's got the bike trailer. Oh, man. I don't know if I can give a review on this or not, really, because, like I say, I've only done... 12 miles on it. Well, I do like it because it's not too wide. A lot of the tourers, they're a bit, a bit portly, a bit round, a bit tubby. But this one here, you could quite easily um, split traffic on, if you're allowed to, that is. Which we're not here. Cruising! Do, 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 Ooh, look! Are these Harley riders? Let's annoy some Harley riders on a jet bike! What if we even get any acknowledgement? Oh, these, these are badasses! Check these badasses out. Crazy horse, Bradenton, Florida. <laughs> he looked at me straight at me and then uh, nothing. I've got a poster at home that says Harley Davidson's. Let's see if I can get this wording right. The best way to turn gasoline into noise without the side effect of horsepower. Nothing. They're too badass for that. Hammer keeps getting hung up on my uh, jacket. I'm kind of hoping it's not pulling the mic out. So if I've got home and there's no footage or no sound, I'm going to be a little bit annoyed. It's Palmasola Bay. We used to come down with the jet skis. Yeah, hopefully, old man, my old man just bought those jet skis as well. So hopefully, we're going to get some jet ski footage. I'm gonna probably make a little video of my holiday time in the States. 
my best bits. Feels like I can't really put it for its paces because I'll say it's, it's brand new, so I can't go quick. And there's no real twisties around here to test the uh, corner link abilities. This seems to go straight and get to a an inter uh, interchange, interchange, junction, whatever. You know what I mean. This bed will be a queue to get on the island. And I'm not allowed to lane split it. That would suck. I can see the water. I'm not used to such a light clutch. <laughs> Mine's a... Uh, uh, much, much heavier than this. Oh, it is the art. It's the key to get on the island. Oh man, man, why can't I split? Let's try. See so we can change modes. Let's try touring. You can only switch modes when you're in uh, neutral. Can't do it whilst you're driving. It's got a little uh, power adapter in there, which can only be open when the keys in the ignition. How very clever. So I bought my dad that clamp for his uh, for his phone and sat nav before um, I knew he was <laughs> selling it. And now it's not going to work on this because it's got like the square bars, square risers. Well, that sucks. The power in the touring mode is, it's not as abrupt. It's like a, a whoosh. It's like, rather than being sort of, um, how can I explain it? Rather than being, say if you're behind a rope on a boat, uh, like if you're getting water skied, um, uh, it's not abrupt, it's not sudden. Whereas it's, it's like, it's like, almost like a bungee on the rope. So when you pull away, it takes a slack up and it's like a, a whooshing, a whoosh. My man, what is the matter with me? Uh, sensation on it. Why well, change when you're stationary? Or well, maybe you can change when you're in, when you move in. Let's try. Well, you can do it with the clutch in. Yeah, it's much more abrupt. Let's put it in Tory mode. Let's try the same roll on. In sp yeah, I don't know if you you can feel it more than you can hear it. Speed up without using my throttle hand. Speed limit thirty-five. Oh! <laughs> Goes alright. Should I stop? Am I meant to stop then? I don't know. Don't know these laws. I do believe it's this one. Well done. There is a there's a vehicular come in here. <laughs> Valley parking, my ass. I'm about to stick it just here. Should I stick on the center stand? Yeah. 
Yeah. We're here at the restaurant. <laughs>